so hello guys and welcome to my channel sir. today again i am back with another important numericals on power plant design sir. so here we have a numerical sir. a silent pole generator of 5 pmba and short circuit ratio of 1.1 is given here and estimate the synchronous reactance sub transient reactance in ohms and what value of grounding resistance would you recommend and what means of grounding would be most economical and why and assume x equivalent as 7.5 ohms so here the very first step we'll do we know the short circuit ratio is given as 1 upon xs in per unit and here from here we can calculate x xs per unit as 1 upon scr and scr is given as 1.1 so 1 upon 1.1 gives 0 0.909 per unit and in order to calculate the synchronous reactance xs so xs will be equal equals to xs per unit here just to have obtained the value of xs per unit means which is 0 0.909 per unit into x equivalent so here we have 0 0.909 into x equivalent and here we have to assume x equivalent as 7.5 ohms so x equivalent will be 7.5 ohm so access to synchronous reactance will be right now 6.817 ohm on calculations similarly the transient reactance so in order to calculate the transient reactance we have to consider 30 percent of this synchronous reactance so 30 percent of synchronous reactance will be 0 0.30 into 6.817 and on calculation we will get here 2.04 ohms now assuming 10 percent is of winding unprotected so here x equivalent will be kv square upon mba and x equivalent is 7.5 in the question so we have to assume x equivalent as 7.5 here we have assuming x equivalent as 7.5 ohm so 7.5 equal to kv square upon mba and again mb is given as 5 mba so kv will be 6.123 kilovolt and that will be equivalent to 6 kilovolt and now voltage induced in 10 percent is of unprotected windings so for unprotected winding it will be 10 percent is of a vp means this kilovolt will be in phase so 6 upon root 3 so we'll get here 0 0.346 kilovolt now assuming out of balance current to be 20 percent is of full load current so it will be 20 percent is of full load and here 20 percent means 0 0.20 into full load and in order to calculate the full load we have a 5 mba given so 5 mba means 5 into 10 power 6 upon root 3 into 6 kilovolt here we have obtained the value of kv as 6 kilovolt here so from here we have used kv as 6 kilovolt so 0 0.20 into 5 into 10 power uh, 10 to the power 6 upon root 3 into 6 kilovolt means 6 into 10 power 3 so you'll get the value of out of balance current so value of i will be 96 amperes now impedance offered by 10 percent is of unprotected winding to the earth fault current so it will be vp upon i and we have obtained kilovolt as 6 kilovolt and here we have to use a phase voltage so 6 kv means 6 into 1000 upon root 3 and i means 96 ampere this value so it will get will get the value of z so z will be 36 ohms now reactance of 10 percent is unprotected winding so it will be 10 percent is of 6.817 kilovolt 6.817 from here we have used this value this value synchronous reactance access means 6.817 ohm so reactance of 10 percent is on particular one will be 10 percent is of 6.817 so you'll get the value of x as 0 0.687 now required earthing resistance since we need to calculate the required earthing resistance according to the questions so for that it will be root under z square minus x square and we have obtained the value of z and that is 36 ohm and similarly the value of x is 0 0.687 ohms so the value of r will be 36 ohms now at the conclusion we can write here preferring grounding will be low impedance that is resistive type because it limits the magnitude of transient over voltage thereby reducing the equipment damage and in addition to that the fault current is limited to a predetermined value established by simple ohms law calculations and this type of grounding is generally used for medium and high voltage systems so in this way you can calculate such type of problems
Hope you enjoy the lectures. Thanks for watching. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you.